Hello dear students of class 7 and welcome to yet another online class of general knowledge. Dear children, today we will continue with the 14th lesson of your GK book, World of Reptiles. Now dear children, reptiles are one of the oldest organisms to exist on this earth, right? They are one of the oldest. In fact, it is believed that some of the reptiles, especially present lizards, have descended directly from the dinosaurs of Jurassic and Triassic period. So, presently, what do we know about reptiles? What we know about reptiles is that, first of all, they have scales on their body. On their body. They have scales on their body hard plate like biostructures on their body it acts kind of like armor for them it acts like an armor for them next you have they are cold blooded they are cold blooded now, when we say they are cold-blooded, what do we understand here is that it's not like their blood is cold, okay? It means that they are not able to regulate their body temperature by themselves. They need an external source to regulate their body temperature. You see, in case of human beings, the normal body temperature is 37 degrees Celsius. It means no matter how hot or how cold it gets outside, our internal body temperature always stays constant at 37 degrees Celsius. If it goes above or below, then we are supposed to have fever. But in case of reptiles, they can't regulate their body temperature like that. They need to depend on an external source, especially when it comes to heating themselves. And next, they lay eggs. They lay eggs. All right. When we say they lay eggs, we understand that they are oviparous animals, okay? They are oviparous animals. They lay eggs. So these are the three characteristics. They have scales, they are cold-blooded, and they lay eggs. Now, dear children, reptiles, some of the reptiles are very, very rare, all right? And that's the reason in black market, reptiles are very much sought after. You see, reptiles are hunted, killed, the, their leather is used to make belts, bags, boots. Not only that, dear children, reptiles okay, are also sought after as they are kept by pet by many enthusiasts who don't know that if these reptiles are removed from their natural habitat, they tend to die. They tend to die. So, these particular reptiles need to be protected, need to be protected like you might be hearing on facebook and all news time to time in our area only right ssb and police they catch people who are trying to smuggle geckos right a lizard like creature it is soft after as it is kept as pet but it is illegal to do so and these animals require our protection so today we'll be learning about some of the largest heaviest biggest reptiles of the world all right so we'll continue with that world's rarest reptile world's rarest reptile means it is it has been hunted almost to ex ex extinction and now very 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 few reptiles of this particular species remain and that would be galapagos giant turtle galapagos giant turtle all right world's rarest reptile is galapagos giant turtle 
in it is found in the Galapagos Island only. Hence, it has been named Galapagos Giant Turtle. Next, you have world's heaviest reptile. This particular reptile weighs around 2000 kg. Weights around 2000 kg. This is the world's heaviest reptile. And that would be saltwater crocodile. Saltwater crocodile. Now one funny fact about uh, crocodile, actually we will not call it funny, it's very dangerous. But crocodiles cannot bite off, cannot tear off the flesh from their prey. So whenever they catch the prey, they perform something which is known as death roll. What they will do is they will catch the prey and they will turn themselves in the water like a fan. And this way what happens? The flesh tears off. They can't bite and pull it back and tear it like we do. But whatever the case is, the saltwater crocodile is the world's heaviest reptile and it can weigh around 2000 kilos. <coughs> then comes number three. These are the only, these are the only sea going lizards on the earth. Lizards on the earth. This particular species of lizard is the only sea going lizard in the world. There are some more facts given here. Their brown or green color adaptation is powerful as they match the rocks and use their razor sharp teeth to eat algae from the rocks. You see, this particular lizard it survives by eating algae, and to eat that algae, it can bite it off the rocks with its razor sharp teeth and its green and brown color adaptation is very very powerful its camouflaging technique is flawless so this particular lizard is marine iguana marine iguana all right so, coming to the next, number four, world's heaviest snake, heaviest snake about, about 227 kg, okay, this is the world's Heaviest snake, most of you by now must have figured out which snake I am talking about. And it can weigh around 227 kg. And your answer for this one is Green Anaconda. Found in the Amazon forests of South America. Green anaconda is the world's heaviest snake. Like it states here, it can weigh about 227 kgs. Now dear children, few of the... Mm, few of the... What do you call... Travelers, okay? Forest travelers, enthusiasts, adventurers. They have stated in their records that they have seen anaconda as large as 18 meters tall. However, the largest anaconda caught till now is only 13 meters. Yet, they believe that they have seen anaconda as large as that. Alright? They are very voracious eaters. They have been known to kill even crocodiles by wrapping themselves around them and constricting it. These kind of uh, snakes are known as constrictors. Okay? Anaconda, boa, python, they are known as constrictors they don't have poison they don't bite and kill their prey instead instead of that they wrap themselves around their prey and 
they apply enough pressure to cr crush its ribs bones muscles and they keep on crushing it till the prey is dead and after that they simply swallow it whole and here comes one more fact dear children snakes can't throw anything out okay snakes can't throw anything out they don't have a choice like when we eat meat what do we do if there is a bone right we uh, chew off all the meat and we throw away the bone but that's not the case with snakes especially not with the constrictors they swallow everything and they digest everything it may take a long time depending on the size of the prey but they digest everything away bone hair nail everything is digested by them okay so as you can see the space is less so i'll be rubbing the board so once before rubbing it let's revise it world's rarest reptile is galapagos giant turtle world's heaviest reptile is saltwater crocodile it can weigh around 2000 kgs and only sea going lizards on the earth with powerful camouflage and raise the sharp teeth they are marine iguana and world's heaviest snake which can weigh around 227 kg is green anaconda coming to number 5 world's largest lizard world's largest lizard about 3 meter long and more than and more than 136 kg This particular lizard is the world's largest lizard. It in size in length it can be around 3 meters long, okay? It can be about 3 meters long. And weight wise it weighs more than 136 kg. Already right, children, and one thing more, in its saliva there are very dangerous pathogens. It means if it bites once, a person is sure to die of sepsis. okay so this particular lizard is known as komodo dragon komodo dragon okay now coming to the next number 6 world's largest turtle world's largest turtle up to 2 meter long up to 2 meter long and 900 kg Okay now this particular turtle is the world's largest turtle okay it can be up to 2 meters long it can grow up to 2 meters long and it weighs about 900 kg okay 900 kg and this particular turtle dear children is known as leatherback c turtle leatherback sea turtle so you see world's largest turtle or the leatherback sea turtle can grow up to 2 meters long and weigh around 900 kg now coming to the seventh one Number seven. I'll simply read it out for you because the fact here is very fascinating. Okay, instead of writing, I'll just read it out to you. It is one of the most beautiful snakes because of its brilliant colors. 
it also has a namesake horn this is the this is one of the snakes which has namesake horn on its mouth and these are namesake because they don't have any purpose they simply add to its beauty this particular snake is rhinoceros rhinoceros rat snake okay rhinoceros rat snake so dear children this ends the chapter you will note down everything as it is given on the board in your copy and you will also solve the quiz time given on the page in the copy for your help i'll be providing you the pics of the pages all right thank you very much stay safe